giving y'all no intro. No, let me give you the backstory on this. FedEx was playing with your girl, but it's here now. And my only concern is just that it's not broken. Is there anything I need to say before I open this? Or I just cut the camera on and start opening it? Don't y'all hate when people take too long? Is there a this side up thing? That's not gonna be the thumbnail. Where is the this side up? Oh, okay. I watched a few reviews on this. Not a lot of people have this one. So I only saw about three. Ugh. But we'll chat about it after I get it open because really I want to open it first before I spend five minutes talking before I even open the thing. So the box is within the box. Gimme! Give Gimme! Give I don't want to rip the box because it's easy to trash it with it. Shucks. Don't let it up too high because you don't want to drop it. <gasps> yes! Ugh. Ow! My foot! Be careful. Just got a pedicure. Okay. One box open. Another one to go. Camera fully charged. Wasn't even expecting this today. I had to call FedEx and just find out some stuff. They supposed to be calling me back on Monday. Oh my goodness, I'm super excited. I don't feel like it's gonna be broken with all of this in here. Hey, what else is it to open? It's definitely not gonna be broken. <laughs> the recording? Oh, I just thought about what I'ma need that I don't got. Oh, I let my brother borrow my drill. Dang it. My drill ain't too bad, it's real bad. Oh. Oh, whoa, that's the mirror. Whoa, it's foam on this side. We gotta flip it over. Shucks, okay. <laughs> yeah! All right, six bulbs on this side, the base, and six more bulbs on that side. And I'll keep it because my brother got my screwdriver. Hello? Okay, this is the. Ah! Now, I'll record it. <laughs> All right, this is the base. This is the base over here. Oh, wait, let me not stand it up here. That's where I gotta put the mirror when I'm done. Alright, got some instructions folks. See what they say. Carefully before operating. We got three screws for the base, four screws for the wall. We're not putting it on the wall. Four anchors, 12 bulbs, and the mirror. I need a Philippine screwdriver. And my brother got mine. <gasps> I know what I didn't do. Hey, I knew it! Shut! Sure. I didn't check where the rain charm sign was. That sign has to be in the front. So you can see what it says. Um, what should I do from here? Oh God. Oh. I just wanna sit this flat. Now that that's flat, we want to show you all what else came in here. If you're going to hang yours on the wall, you have four of these screws and also four of the anchors. I'm not going to hang them out on the wall. I'm going to sit it on my desk, but I'm going to hold on to this in case I ever do want to hang it. I'll have to put this aside in case you ever change your mind and life. Label it vanity mirror while mounting screws. Boom. Real life, this is what I have currently and I normally twist the camera right here. I'll link a video down below where I put this desk together. It's from Ikea. Position y'all over here now. I can't get it by myself. And I have nowhere to trash it just yet, so I can't move it. Here goes nothing. This is my strategy. You can wait and ask for help if you like, but if you're as excited as I am, you just wanna put it up. Plus, I don't need no help, like. And I live, sis. I live, sis. I live. I think, hold on. One, two, three. Oh, shucks, it's heavy. Oh, shucks, boy. <laughs> Oh, 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 Say about putting the bulbs in, do you plug it up and then put the bulbs? Let's put the bulbs in. Oh my god, I got a vanity! Ah! I got a vanity! I got a vanity! I got a vanity! <laughs> oh my goodness! I can see here and do my makeup, do my hair. Oh shucks. Early birthday gift for myself. 
Okay, let's plug her up. Oh, shucks. I've had to slide this bag out the wall. Oh, that scared me. Okay, it just went, thank you. Okay, where we turn it on at? Where do we turn it on at? Okay, move all that. <laughs> we gotta figure this out, but let's turn it on. It doesn't click, you just twist it, okay. Let's clean the mirror really quickly. Let me get the instructions. Okay, I was starting to think it wasn't working, guys. For it to recognize that you're touching it, you have to touch it for like three seconds. So, these are the instructions. Alrighty, what time is it? Five, oops. Oh, come on. Come on. No. It's very sensitive. Wow. Four. One more. One more. One more. Okay, five. 33. So. What? What? Uh. Today is the 13th. Go back up one. No, 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 no. Sunday. Today is Saturday. Got that. All right, so we got that set up. Next thing is setting up the Bluetooth. So I'm gonna press this three seconds and you'll see the icon and you're ready to turn it off from your device. You're gonna search for Rain Charm. All right, so it said USB at first. So we have to click it to where it says blue. Oops, no, 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 this one. Ah, okay, it's connected, girl. Let's see what it looks like from this way. That's what I forgot to do. Most people, they show you their mirror Okay, this is the mirror all the way off. <clears throat> Cause most people when I watch that video, they just held the mirror right here and they never turned it around. So you never got to see what it really looks like. This is me before I began twisting it. I won't adjust the lighting on this clip. I'll insert this footage exactly as it is. As a matter of fact, ring light too. No lights are on in here. Not even the overhead light. Okay, this is me. I'm not gonna adjust the, the lighting on this clip. Now we're gonna start twisting it. Give my camera time to adjust. And this is what we have. Oh my goodness. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. All right, let's listen to some music, shall we? Let's play a song. I know just the song too. Lil Greg. Let it know. This light, it looks so good. Let's see if I'm connected. Is it coming through there? It is. <laughs> I don't know if y'all can hear it, but I can hear it. Volume. I was running up by itself. Hey, hey. Drop five bands and I got a new mirror. Just, just kidding. This didn't cost five bands. <laughs> Some of the ones I saw on the internet did though. This looks so good. Okay, let's go. When you plug up things, the maximum that you don't want to exceed 1875. So if I plug up a flat iron, is that right? I think it is. If you plug up a flat iron and all of that kind of stuff, the speakers are on this side. I don't know if the camera is picking it up, but this is kind of like a mirrored look. This is the knob. It won't focus. Another thing I like about this one too, the reason that I picked it, these bulbs don't get high. This is 12 bulbs that you're sitting right here looking into. You don't want to be sweaty while you're trying to put makeup on. These do not get hot. While I'm sitting there beating my face, I won't be sweating. They won't get hot. Gonna tuck and drop that. Not too much because I want it really pushed up. That's the back. So then over here, I got my two plugs as well as my two USBs and you don't want to exceed 1875 watts. Alright, let's start putting all of my stuff back up here. I don't need this one now. Or do I? I don't. <laughs> I'm gonna store that one in my closet if I ever need it again. So since the plugs are over there, I just pictured this. That looks so good. Like this actually looks like it looks like I record videos in here now. It looks like a film room. 
a film room. Give this video a thumbs up to see another film room room tour. I did one when I kind of started with this room being super empty, bringing it up to the point that it is right now, minus the mirror clearly. He's done a few more things in here. Get this video to 1500 likes and I'll do a new full room tour in here. But since the plugs are on that side, I just picture the plug kind of wobbling up against these. So I'm gonna put these brushes up here. You can set them right here if you want. I personally don't want too much in the way of me doing what I'm doing. Now I need new brush holders. Shucks, I might get a copyright strike from Lil Greg <laughs> or a copyright claim. Lil Greg, don't put no copyright claim on my video. <laughs> Let's see if my phone call comes through the speakers. Hello? Oh, shucks, you ain't coming through the speakers. What? Let me see. I was listening to Joey's music. I'm finna see if I can get you to come through the speakers. Oh, because I put you on speaker, hold on. Oh, why are they connected? It's not doing it, I had to figure it out. So let's go ahead and discuss five little important things right here so while I finish cleaning up and then I'll show you all the before and after. So first off, this video is not sponsored. I did reach out to Rain Charm. I sent them a very professional DM. I won't get into all of that, but just know they left your girl on red, so this video is not sponsored. But of course, all of the details and everything about the mirror will be in the description box down below. It's not affiliated by any means. So the price on the mirror for me using the Happy Fourth coupon code that they had at the time, I got this mirror for 405 US dollars. It would have been 449 otherwise. Yeah, shipping wise, it took six days. I ordered this July the 7th. It was a Sunday. It was supposed to arrive according to my tracking by the 11th of July but the mix-up wasn't really on Rain Charm's part because obviously it was already sent out by then so I had to kind of contact FedEx and we figured everything out it arrived on July the 13th six days as far as everything else guys I would definitely say do your research when you want to purchase something like this because obviously we know pricing on mirrors can be very expensive um, I compare lots of different websites Amazon on Twitter a lot of you all told me to check out Wayfair so even on Wayfair and Amazon, I saw Rain Charm through both of those sites, but believe it or not, purchasing directly from Rain Charm, it was cheaper than Wayfair's website. And then on Amazon, um, you can see a lot of the mirrors, they'll be way cheaper, but they're not the full size bulbs. So that was very important for me, especially if the bulbs go out maybe after a few years or something and I need to replace them, I can easily go to Home Depot to purchase that for myself. And then I also did research as far as like comparing the dimensions, like this mirror may be larger but it costs less, different things like that. So just definitely keep all of those things in mind. After finally doing my research for a few days, I think I shared some of that with you all on Instagram stories. So follow me over there because I kind of share things like that when I'm interested in buying things before the videos make it to YouTube, if they do make it to YouTube. But yeah, black screen, I'm talking too much. This is like my fifth take on this voiceover. So questions and comments, be sure to leave all of that down below. And as always, I thank you all so much for watching.